is going on everybody? Welcome back to Phones and Drones. I wanted to take a quick second and throw this video together because I've had a lot, a lot, a lot of you guys asking how to get the Pixel 2 Live wallpapers as you've seen on this and in my other videos, my Essential Phone, my Note 8, and my OnePlus 5T, uh, how to put them and port them onto those devices. I want to take a quick second, it is super simple, and show you how to do it on my Essential Phone here. All you're going to want to do is go to your browser of choice, and then I will throw the link up in the description, but you're gonna to wanna to go to APK Mirror and look for Pixel Wallpaper 2017 Port 8.1, yada, yada, yada. And as soon as you get to this page, it'll give you all this information about the APK and all these links and advertisements. Make sure not to click on any of those except for the green button right here that says Download APK. You wanna go ahead and click that button and it will actually give you a notification box at the bottom telling you, hey, it is not safe to download all this stuff. You wanna make sure you, uh, uh, of what you're doing before you download it, or it could cause harm and viruses. If for some reason it doesn't start, you can click here. For some reason, I always have a problem with it. We'll refresh it really quick, and there we go. Do you wanna download, yada, yada, yada? Download. You'll get your little notification up here. And as soon as this finishes downloading, you're gonna wanna make sure in your settings menu that you install, uh, It'll you can allow certificates to be installed from unknown sources. Since this is not directly from the Play Store, it is obviously an unknown source. So we have to say yes to that and I will show you exactly how that works in these 10 seconds after this is downloaded. All right, click on the link you just downloaded. Do you wanna install an update? Install it. And as you can see, this is called Pixel Wallpapers 2017. Does not take very long to install. Um, and after that, you are good to go. All right, app installed. Now here's where it's a little tricky. You can't just click open like you normally would when you download an application. What you're gonna do is just say done, close that out, long press on the home screen so you can get your notifications to change your wallpapers and such. And then that crash, let's do it again. Here's your normal wallpapers. And then now at the bottom here, you have the live wallpapers as well. There's the beach one you see I always use. The flyover. These are pretty cool. I personally like them, like I said. I do wanna show you one thing really quick. If you get that notification that I was speaking of, it is in security. And you see how it says unknown sources? Allow installation of apps from unknown sources. Make sure that slider is on or else it would have gave you that error message when you were downloading it. Normally, phones now will take you into the screen and allow you just to check it right there. But that is an important step. It did not ask me to do it since I already had it checked off. And aside from that, then all you're gonna do, pick your wallpaper, set it, and you're good to go. Now you have your live wallpaper on your other Android device. Thanks for watching guys, make sure you subscribe to the channel, thumbs up this video, and leave a comment down below.